mankind, where words fail, music speaks like. This program is part of the Crime Prevention Initiative of the Royal St. Vincent and Grandin's Police Force. It dovetails with the Coast Guard Summer Program, also the Pan Against Crime Program, the Police Youth Club, the TF Program. These are programs where the Royal St. Vincent and Grandin's Police Force we try to um, put things in place to ensure that if youths stay on the straight and narrow. And I'm really happy that this program ended with a success. We have seen where several of the participants perform excellently um, to the pride of their parents. And we're really happy and I really want to say that as we are as the police force as, and as commissioner of police, I fully endorse this program and will continue to promote programs like this. We know that persons out there have less than noble intention and would want to sway the youth in negative ways. So as an organization, we are trying to counteract that. I'm also appealing for sponsorship from the members of the public. So this is a plug for that. It is a water pro venture and I really would like persons to assist us in order to make St. Vincent and Grandin's safer by instilling positive values in the youth of St. Vincent and Grandin's. Inspector Bernard Haynes, who served in the police force for over 36 years, and bandmaster for four years. I was enlisted in the police force in 1980, and I was in the band all my entire life. You know, the police band started in 1951, and had its first engagement in 1952. You now, the summer program, the police band summer program, started in 2008 by ex-commissioner Mr. Keith Miller and it was to give the children a chance to learn music and an opportunity to have a career in music. The term music is defined as vocal or instrumental sounds or both combined in such a way to produce beauty of form, harmony, expression of emotion. Band is defined as a group of people who have a common interest or purpose. More specifically, as it pertains to music, a band is known, or defined as rather, a small group of musicians and vocalists who play music. While attending the police summer band program, it is clear that you would have understood the idea of becoming a band. And last but not least, synergy. Synergy is defined as cooperation of two or more persons in things combined to produce an effect greater than the sum of the separate effects. These three terms have been ably displayed by you today and will continue to be displayed as you continue to express your emotions through music as you would have learned from your instructors at the program. And today you would have utilized these skills to work as a band and achieve synergy through your cooperation. Bishop's College Kingston. My experience from this band room is that I was playing from six years of age and I have came this far that I can graduate again. This might be the eighth certificate I have received and I feel good about it because music is my passion and it's just something that I love and 
I can't stop doing it. I have played Panorama for the St. Vincent and the Grenadines Police Band Room for many years now by the Officer Wilson and Officer Bristol. Officer Bristol, please help me grow into music. As I was small, I loved music. Because I just attend this school much and I and I'm so happy that I get have, have get this award because for the longest while I never have had a job and so on like this. I so thank you for how this get this award. So thank you for inviting me and I so thank you very much. I feel so amazing, I feel so great. What Tara God came to they say. God is so bringing me to something international. Over the sexual period, these kids were exposed to different instruments. They had the drum set, keyboards, bass guitar, rhythm guitar, recorders, clarinet, trombone and I must say at this point I was very impressed and pleased to see the amount of persons that gravitated to brass instrument in this year's program. As a matter of fact, it's the first time I've seen female coming forward to play the instrument as it's called the trombone, one of the most difficult instruments to play. So give yourself another round of applause for me please. Today is a very happy day for me, a very good day. And not only for me, I believe the Commissioner of Police and the entire police force are very proud of what took place here today. My task as leader of the band is to make sure that all the affairs of the police band will be well. And it's not only me, I am assisted by two sergeants, and about five corporals, and about 19 constables. And I must thank them at this point for the support that they have given me thus far. Since I'm, I, I, I take leadership of the U.S. since I'm going to this police force man. During this program, the kids were only taught music. They did a bit, a bit of tie dyeing and so on. We had other times when we had a little recreation. We should have had more. But as I said at the closing ceremony, the time did not permit us to really do all that we, we had wanted. But music was the soul, was the not soul, but the primary purpose was having the program. So those classes that we would have missed during the program, all in the program, we compensated the kids more or less with one more week. So I just want to thank the commissioner, we close thank the commissioner and the persons in the upper, 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 upper echelon of the police force for giving us the opportunity to run this program. I want to thank them very much. And I know he is proud, as I said before. And I want to proud. thank you very much for airing our program and for letting the world know what the police ban has done here in St. Vincent and Grenadines during the month of July and August. So thank you all very much for having me. God bless you all. We can't tell you what you all are doing.